So we woke up to a dreary, cold, wet morning. But we're on our way to Anchorage to pick up a part for our sway bar that broke on our van. And then hopefully we can have somebody fix it today and get back on the road once we get to Anchorage, right? Right. And then the plan is to travel down to the Kenai Peninsula and spend a few days down there possibly. So stick around. It's another Squatch Dog adventure. Lots of road construction this time of year, Brad. Yeah, we timed this one pretty good. I think those guys in the front probably sat there for a while. We just got here. Yeah, that's true. For the good point. Second to last car. Well, these big mountains are clouded over today for the most part. But we'll be back through this area on our way up to Denali and hopefully it'll clear off, right? I think it's possible. Park and be cloudy for the rest of our trip. Don't say that. <laughs> Don't even put that out there. No. Who has? Some nicer weather's coming. That's true. Entering the town of Palmer, Alaska, which is the home to Abby, who is Riker's mom, and Bob, which is Riker's brother, and Crystal, who is the owner of Abby and Bob, along with some other dogs. It's pretty here in Palmer. Even when it's cloudy, it's really pretty. We are now in Anchorage, Alaska, and we're on the hunt for the post office so we can pick up some parts that were shipped, up, shipped to us so we could fix our sway bar that broke somewhere along the road. We went to the post office to pick up our package and it came. It hey. came. So now we got to get those installed onto the van, don't we? Yep. Let's see if we can find someone that can do it. Okay, sounds good. Let's go. Then we can go down dirt road. Searching for a place that can actually install the parts onto our van so that we can continue on and get on some really gnarly roads, right? Hope so. I have to find someone that can do it fast. Fast today. <laughs> have some beautiful mountains all around it. Everywhere you look you see mountains. We're dropping the van off at Midas. It sounds like they're gonna do it. They're gonna squeeze us in today and get it done. Stop and get a little bit of pho. Vietnamese food while we're waiting for the van to get finished. How is it? Yummy. And our van is on the rack. Thank you so much to Midas. So we dumped, filled up, had lunch, got the um, links on the sway bar fixed in the place, and now we're on our way to Seward, right? That direction, we're not going all that way. We are going to stop at a really cool place, right? I think so. Portage Glacier, I think. Portage Glacier, I like it. Sounds like a fun place. Let's go. Join us at Portage Lake. Join us at Portage Glacier.
is our camping spot for the night. Glacial blue water. There's the glacier right over there. I decided who the next pope is going to be. The black smoke is coming out of the chimney stack. Yeah, things you find in Alaska. It's crazy. Yeah. I don't know who it is. <laughs> Titanic doesn't hit one of those. So this iceberg here is apparently making its way towards us. We're hoping that by the end of the night it will come to us and then we will break it up, put chunks of it in our glass and pour whiskey over it and drink whiskey out of it. That would be cool, literally. Alas, we were unable to drink whiskey with glacial ice. However, we did have a great time nonetheless. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, like and subscribe. Meantime, happy trails.